You want to know what I realized in 2023? These people in 2023 be openly hating on people. Like, I remember back when I was growing up, it used to be shameful to be jealous of another person. Like, it was an embarrassment for you to sit there and just be jealous of another person because when you're jealous of somebody you're actually acknowledging I think you're better than me you make me feel like you're more important than me I feel like you're more important than me that's what you're admitting what you're admitting to be jealous of somebody you're doing better than me you're shining harder than me in this game of life you winning and I'm losing and you never, never, never want to admit that. Because if you admit that, then you're admitting to defeat, you know. A retreat, no defeat. <laughs> you know what I mean? When I was growing up, like, the last thing you want to be caught, being called is jealous-hearted or a hater. You know what I mean? They, I remember when they first came out with those shirts, when Mano made that song, Hi, Hater, Hi, Hater, You See Me, Hi, Hater. And they had those shirts called. They had the other shirts in New York that said, caught you hating. Because you actually have to catch somebody hating. Like, you couldn't just, like, if you accuse somebody of being a hater, like, a person would sit there and argue you down. Like, what you talking about? I'm not jealous to you. Jealous to you for what? What I gotta be hating on you for? It's in your mind. Nobody hating on you. Like, you have to actually catch somebody literally hating. You know what I mean? By like, being a hater was up there with being a snitch. Like, it was that serious. Like, it, that's how shameful it was to be a hater. Like, being a hater was, like, the equivalent of being a snitch or a tattletale. Like, all of that was some rat, dirt McGirt, just shameful stuff. And now people just be out here openly hating on people. You know what I mean? And I'm sitting here talking to this, talking to this dude. And he just, like, going down his Facebook page, I guess. And I'm working, you know. And he's just like, I don't like this, this thing to be. And I'm sitting here looking at him like, okay. Like, what you talking about? And I'm like, what he do? And he's like, oh, no, he just think he, like, he be trying to carry it. Like, he just, like, what you mean? Like, carry it like what? Like, what he be saying? What he be on there? He be on there saying some crazy stuff. Nah, he don't be saying no crazy stuff. He just, he just be trying to act like he all that. And I be like, and because I'm not a hater. I ain't never hated on nobody in my life. I don't even know what it feels like to be a hater. Now, don't get me wrong. I've looked at people and felt a little jealous hearted every once in a while because I'm a human being. But I instantly shook that off and be like, nah, I'm not even about to live like that because that's not. It. I'm not that person. So whenever I find myself being jealous of somebody, whatever I'm jealous of them for, I, I need to step my stuff up and get my life together. You know what I mean? Like, I need to step it up, obviously. I look at it like inspiration, motivation for me to go ahead and I need to go harder. Whatever that person got that make me feel some kind of way, I need to get that too. And I need to do what I need to do to get it, you know? Because me sitting around dwelling on being jealous of somebody, that's not my style. Like, that's not cool. I'm trying, I'm admitting that this person is more important than me. And after me, it's Jesus. It got to be. Ain't no other way, you know? And that's how everybody should feel like feel, feel about themselves. It should be the most high and then you and then your kids and then everybody else, you know. So yeah, like these people nowadays don't have no and and me, who's not about to even sit there and support you, nobody hating on nobody else. It's like, okay, let's change the subject. Like you, you obviously don't have a good enough reason not to like this man, whoever this man is, God bless that man. But I'm not about to sit here and support you hating on nobody else. Because if you don't have a good reason to like somebody, that means you're just hating. So, and I'm not finna sit here and hate with you because that's not my style. These people nowadays in 2023 would just openly be jealous of you and don't have no shame. Like, you should be ashamed if you're jealous of anybody else. If anybody else make you feel some kind of way about you, then you should be embarrassed. That's an embarrassment. You understand what I'm saying? And that's a lot of the times these people be like, you don't have any shame. You don't have any shame. You don't have any shame. You're not embarrassed of the stuff that you say and the stuff that you do. So why should I? Stop hating on people. If you have a, if you feel some kind of way about somebody, step your cookies up before they crumble. All right? Bye.